Right, good morning. Uh, I didn't uh, do a, another vlog last night because I thought it was nice to leave it off on the way that I did. And um, so today we're going to be driving all the way down to Pepignon and then going inland a little bit towards the Pyrenees, but not really far into the Pyrenees. And we're going to be going to a little, oh, I don't know if it's a little, but a village called Il Soutet. And near this place there is a um, magnificent rock formation called Les Orges. So that should be fun to see. And then after that we're going to be taking the car a little bit further into the mountains, but not too far. To a place, to well, a mountain village called Castanou. So that should also be fun. And then after that, we don't know what we're doing, but that's just the rough plan for today. So, yet a lovely, lovely, sunny, beautiful day. This is going to be perfect. So we're at the petrol station. This is interesting, but um, I was just going to say, I feel like I vlogged horribly this morning. I must have looked terrible. I'd only just woken up but I don't know if I should redo it or anything because it's now like already travelling to our location, Il Soutet. Yeah. Okay, so we're now in um, Il Soutet, which is a settlement that's just outside of Les Orges, which is this magnificent rock um, formation. Uh, we just stopped here to get like a quick um, drink because we felt like it and uh, we should be driving out of this place and it's only, it's only like five minutes away. So, I'm cool. Also, it is extremely windy here, now that we're very close to the Pyrenees, the uh, mountains on the Spanish-French border. I just thought I'd add that in case I look very wind-swept. Okay, so we're now it's um, Les Orges. It is extremely windy here, so I don't know if you can hear me, but if you look behind me, that is the edge of Les Orges, like the edge cliffs, and we have to like walk up a valley, and we'll, um, gosh, it's so windy. Uh, that will take us to the main parts where everyone goes to the sea, and it should be really cool, so let the music roll.
I don't know if you can hear me, but because it's so windy, but this place is just amazing. I never expected this gorge to be so fantastic. It's just magnifique. Oh, and look behind me. Do you see how beautiful this is? And the views? I just can't believe this. I don't know how Castel New is going to live up to it. Just wow. <laughs> Okay, so we've now left, um, I start everything with okay, but anyway, we've now left um, Les Orges and um, we're going to be leaving the Il Soutet area and we're going to be going to um, Castel Nou. I don't know how it's going to compare to Les Orges. I'm currently in the car park for like the, um, the place and it only costs five euros I think, so Considering what it's how magnificent it is, it's really worth it. I'm trying to get a good angle of like the outskirts of it, but you can't really see it from here. I found it amazing, and it's I'm willing to say that it is in my top five places that I have ever visited in my whole life. It was that amazing. Anyway, time for us to go to Castel New. This is just amazing. We're almost at Castel Nou. If you look behind me, there's Castel Nou, I believe. But the view is just fantastic. Okay, so I'm now in Castel Nou. My mum and her partner have uh, decided to get a drink because they're exhausted after Les Orges. And I'm going to be exploring the mountain village by myself. Thank you. 
that's also another magnificent location. And like both of the places I've been today are just so lovely and I would definitely recommend coming to them. I'm going to talk a bit more later because there are people coming, like right now. <laughs> I'm probably really dark here, I can't quite tell, but um, I don't know, Castellu, I would I have to come back here again, because we're only going to be here for an hour this time, because uh, my mum and her partner are getting quite tired, but it's just amazing. I'd love to like climb some of the mountains in the Pyrenees. I don't know, it's just, it's just so lovely. It's one of the best places I've ever been. So, I'm in the belief that it's you have to go like around the hills a little bit to get to the very top where the chateau is or castle. Uh, I can't see it at the moment. Mate, you might be able to sort of there, but um, I don't have time to do that, so I have to come back another time to Castellou. But I mean, look at the view, it's just spectacular. I'm having so much fun, and I recommend anyone to come here. They have to come here at some point. The Pyrenees is just amazing. Anyway, I'm heading back down this really long path that I discovered. Here we go. Okay, so my mum's just told me that I'll be able to go to the castle at the top because I have a bit more time, so let's go. Well, looks like I can't visit the castle anyway. Oh, my camera was a bit strange there. Because you have to pay and I have no money on me. My mum has all that and she's down at the very bottom of the hill in the car and there's no way I'm climbing back up again this time. So, when I come to Castellou in the future, hopefully I can have a look at it then. As for now, I'm going to walk back down to the car and then hopefully head home. Although I think they have plans, um, my mum and her partner want to uh, visit the Mediterranean Sea, like just to dip their toes in because they said that that'd be nice. So who knows, there might be a bit more vlogging today. <sighs> you know what, that might have been quite a negative way to end my visit at Castellou. So I have to say, I really enjoyed today, as I've said already so many times. Um, so I went to uh, Su El Soutet, there we go, um, and stopped there to get a drink. That was very lovely. Oh, look at the castle behind me. Well, not castle, church, right there. That's quite nice. Uh, and uh, we had a drink in Il Soutet, and then we went to Les Orges, which is one of the most magical places I have ever been to in my life. <laughs> So, there's wind, that's why I just shouted just then. I'm a bit random and a bit hyper actually. Anyway, oh look at the castle. Like there, the castle. If I had some money, I could go in it. But anyway, um, Le Les Orges, there's nothing to describe it. It was just lovely. It was just so magical, so beautiful. I recommend anyone to go there. It's, like, if I'm going to make a list of my top places that I've ever 
been to, that would be on it. And then after that, we went up the Pyrenees Road to Casterlou, which was magnificent. I've never seen the Pyrenees this close before, or even really been them, in them. I've been to Couleur, which is sort of by the sea on the edge of them, so I don't know if that counts. I've also been to Pepignon before, but that's sort of on a plane just outside the Pyrenees, I would say. And uh, Castellou is a beautiful mountain village. It's exactly what I hoped it would be. Uh, I don't know, it's just got a lovely feeling, and I feel like that anyone who would come here, it would just bring them happiness.